Do you know who's Bill Gates? Bill Gates is the most richest in the world. Okay. Yes, that is correct. Okay. He is the most richest person in the world. Why do you think? Yusuf, why? He created Microsoft. And? And, um, he has a big house. <laughs> he has a big house. Okay, anyone who wants to um, give another answer? Alright, let's go ahead and continue. When it comes to technology as well, okay, he is really good in technology. Now, let's go ahead and learn more about Bill Gates. Alright, now we have a video here because we only know that he is the most richest man and he is the one who created uh, Microsoft. But let's know more about a, the story on how he started Microsoft and who who is Bill Gates. Now let's go ahead and let's go ahead and watch a video about him. Who is Bill Gates? October 1955. Bill Gates is born. Shortly after 9 p.m. in Seattle, Washington, William Bill Henry Gates III was born to William H. II and Mary Maxwell Gates. His unique brain power and curiosity for technology were discovered early in childhood. January 1967, Bill Gates Education. Gates is enrolled in the Lakeside School, an exclusive private school in Seattle, where he befriends Paul Allen. Bill Gates and Paul Allen both share an interest in computers and programming. June 1969, first computer program. Gates took an interest in programming the GE system in BASIC. At age 13, he wrote his first computer program on a computer, which was an implementation of tic-tac-toe that allowed users to play games against the computer. February 1973, enrolls in Harvard University. After graduating from Lakewood School, being National Merit Scholar and scoring 1590 out of 1600 on the SAT, Gates gets enrolled in Harvard University where he studied pre-law influenced by his father. But later his focus is shifted towards computers and programming. May 1975 calls Mitz for a job. Bill Gates signs up for a job with MITS from his dorm room to develop software for the MITS Altair starting his journey of programming. He later marks his first absence from school, dropping out in the same year to start working on the software venture he refers to as Microsoft. May 1976 Registers Microsoft Trademark Gates and Allen register the trademark Microsoft. Gates writes an open letter to computer hobbyists condemning the early adopters for sharing rather than paying for software. April 1977, setting up Microsoft. Gates takes a second leave of absence from Harvard and sets up Microsoft in Albuquerque, NM, where MITS is headquartered. Microsoft's year-end sales exceeds $1 million in 1978, gaining Bill a reputation for being tough but focused. August 1981, Microsoft launches MS-DOS system. Microsoft incorporates and buys the rights to the operating system DOS from Seattle Computer Products and provides its license to IBM. Followed by this, in 1983, Allen leaves Microsoft after developing Hodgkin's disease and Microsoft announces Windows as an extension of its MS-DOS operating system. November 1985, Microsoft Windows and IBM. Bill launched the first retail version of Microsoft Window. In August of the following year, Microsoft struck a deal with IBM to develop a separate operating system called OS-2. 
although the partnership deteriorated due to creative differences. November 1987, youngest billionaire in the world. At age 31, Gates becomes the youngest billionaire ever. He meets his future wife, Melinda French, at a Microsoft event in New York the same year. September 1989, Emergence of Corbus. Gates found Corbus, an archive of art and photography from public and private collections. Corbus later becomes one of the largest collections of visual information in the world. September 1990, Bill vs. State. The Federal Trade Commission began an investigation into possible collusion between IBM and Microsoft for divvying up the market for operating systems in an anti-competitive way. The matter was later settled in 1994. March 1994, Gates marries Melinda. Bill Gates and Melinda French got married in 1994 on a golf course on the Hawaiian island of Linnea. They had three children together, Jennifer, Rory, and Phoebe. In the same year, they found one of the largest private foundations in the world, Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation. July 1995, Richest Man Alive. At age 39 and with a fortune of $12.9 billion, Gates becomes the world's richest man. Later that summer in 1995, Microsoft introduces Internet Explorer to the world as part of Windows 95. Gates begins to shift Microsoft's focus toward the emerging Internet. May 1998, Microsoft faces lawsuit. The U.S. Justice Department charges Microsoft with engaging in anti-competitive and exclusionary practices designed to maintain its monopoly in personal computer operating systems and to extend that monopoly to internet browsing software. May 2000 Steps Down as Microsoft CEO Gates steps down as CEO of Microsoft. Gates' former Harvard dorm mate and right-hand man, Steve Ballmer, takes over the helm, while Gates becomes a chief software architect. July 2005, honoring Bill Gates. Queen Elizabeth II bestows an honorary knighthood on Gates for his contributions to the United Kingdom. Time names him a Person of the Year, along with Melinda Gates and Bono for what the magazine called his Good Samaritan work. December 2007, Gates graduates from Harvard after dropping out. The university awards him with an honorary degree. Gates gives the commencement speech, encouraging the graduates to strive for social change. Humanity's greatest advances are not in its discoveries, but in how those discoveries are applied to reduce inequity. February 2014, Microsoft to Philanthropy. Gates stepped down as chairman of Microsoft and currently serves as an advisor to support CEO Satya Nadella. He dedicated himself to Bill and Melinda Foundation and focused on global issues of climate change, global health and development, and education. March 2020, all I care about is the world. Bill Gates is currently the fourth richest in the world with a worth of $123 billion. On March 13, 2020, Gates left his board positions at Berkshire Hathaway and Microsoft to dedicate himself to his philanthropic endeavors. In 2011, Gates says, in fact, if you gave me a choice of picking the next 10 presidents or having energy be a quarter as expensive and environmentally friendly, I'd, which one could improve things better, I'd, I'd pick the energy thing. All right. I mean, that is the answer of our question. Who is Bill Gates and how did he start at uh, Microsoft and how he was able to... Uh, successfully create Microsoft. Alright, so 
before we go on with our article, let's go ahead and let's learn some vocabulary as well. Uh, the first vocabulary that we have here is, okay, entrepreneurship. Okay, entrepreneurship. Okay, everyone, please repeat after me. Entrepreneurship. Okay, so now we are going to know what is entrepreneurship, okay? So entrepreneurship is a skill in starting new businesses, especially when this involves seeing new opportunities. Let me ask someone to read what to read again the meaning of entrepreneurship. Okay, let me, uh, can we have number 34 from 5 slash 7? Okay, please read. Okay. So for for those people who are selling masks, this is the opportunity for them to really grow their business, right? Because we really need that uh, that this time. Okay, now the second vocabulary we have is liveliness. Okay, to call everyone liveliness. Liveliness. Okay, so when we say liveliness, it is the quality of being interesting and exciting. Okay, now let's have someone to read the meaning again. Okay, 5 slash 6, number 10. Number 10. Okay, please read. Quality of being interesting and exciting. Okay, thank. What's your nickname? Earn. Earn. Okay, thank you so much, Earn. So as you can see in our picture here, okay, uh, the our picture is very uh, alive or lively. Okay, so if you are interesting to into something, you are excited. Okay. To do uh, that thing. Now let's go to our next vocabulary. So we have famous. Okay. Now we already learned this one in our previous uh, topic, but let's just go ahead and refresh our mind. Okay. Everyone, please repeat after me. Famous. Famous. Okay. Now, so when we say famous, okay. These are the kind of person that, okay, let me call 5 slash 7 number 26. 5? Yes. Okay, please read. Famous. No and. Recognized. Re recognized by many people. Okay, what's your nickname again? Tong? On. Ah, on. Okay. So, known and recognized by many people okay now i know you already understand what famous is now can you give me an example of a famous person mark zuckerberg yes mark zuckerberg and what did what did mark zuckerberg found or created facebook right yes facebook how about others Michael Jordan. Ah, oh, Michael Jordan. Why why he is famous? This is the greatest gold. This is a gold. <laughs> gold. So he is actually in when it comes to basketball, he is famous, right? Because he's really he's good. Ready. Yeah. He uh, has a signature, iconic signature. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Now, let's go ahead. Thank you so much, Krim and Yusef. Now, let's go to our next vocabulary. So, we have emerging. Okay. Everyone, please repeat after me. Emerging. Emerging. Okay. Emerging meaning? Starting to exist. 
It is. Okay. Now let's go to our next vocabulary. So we have high spirited. Okay, everyone, please repeat after me. High spirited. High spirited. Okay, so when we say high spirited, okay, let's uh let's have uh, Yusuf please read. A high spirited person is energy energetic 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 and happy and likes doing exciting and enjoyable things all right let's go to our next vocabulary so we have software okay everybody please repeat after me software software okay so when we say software okay let's have five slash seven number 12 to read it for us Particular. Okay. Now let's go to our next vocabulary. So we have develop. Okay, everyone, please repeat after me. Develop. 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 All right. So when we say develop, okay, let's have number uh, from five slash six number thirty four. Hello. Okay. Uh, please read. To cause something to grow or shape into a more advanced, advanced, advanced version or stronger form or create our product, especially by deliberate. Over time. Okay, so meaning develop is to, okay, it is just a simple word, okay, it is to create, okay, to create or to produce, okay. So now let's go ahead to our next, um, okay, so our next vocabulary is regent, okay, everyone please repeat after me, regent. Regent. Okay, so Regent is okay. Let's have number five slash six, number 29. I'm 29. Yes, okay, please read. A person who rules a country for remit period because the king or queen is absent or too young to hear it is sick. Okay, so regent is a person who rules a country for a limited period because the king or queen is absent or too young or too ill or any other reasons, etc. So example, if your if your king is not um, is not around, okay, he will appoint someone, okay, he will ask someone to lead the country during his absence. So now let's go to our next one. So we have computer. Okay, everyone, please repeat after me. Computer. 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 Okay. Now when we say computer, okay, uh, when you say the word, it's not computer. Okay, computer. Okay, to con again, computer. All right. Now let's go again from five slash seven. Five slash seven, number fifteen. Okay, please read. All oh, and yes. And uh, uh, electronic machine machine <laughs> that is used for something. <laughs> Organ okay, uh, uh, organizing. Organizing and finding words, numbers, and pictures for doing calculations and for controlling other 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 machines. Okay, thank you. 
So computer is an electronic machine that is used for storing, organizing, and finding words, numbers, and pictures for doing cal calculations and for controlling other machines. So now let's go to our next vocabulary. We have business. Tokon, repeat after me. Business. 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 Okay. A business is the activity of buying and selling goods and services. So, now let's go to our next vocabulary. The next one is undergraduate. Okay, everyone, please repeat after me. Undergraduate. Undergraduate. Okay, so when we say undergraduate, okay, Cream, can you read it for us? A student, a student who is studying for their first degree at a college or university. Okay, so when you finish your your degree, then you will be called a graduate. But if you didn't finish, all right. Example: You only uh, study for two years until se uh, second year. Uh, in college, then you stop studying. Okay, so you will be called as undergraduate. Now let's go to our next vocabulary. So we have company. Okay, everyone, please repeat after me. Company. 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 Okay, so when we say company, okay, okay uh, Yusef, can you please read it for us? Okay, please read. that sells goods or service in order to make money okay so we have business now if there is a business there is a company okay so the company will provide or will sell a goods or service so uh, carry is a company and their business is through package okay they are sending uh, package or documents okay already in our in our article now I will read it first okay uh, and after this I will ask question let's see okay. Bill Gates came from a family of entrepreneurship and high-spirited liveliness William Henry Gates the third was born in Seattle Washington on October 28 1955 his father, William H. Gates II, is a Seattle attorney. His late mother, Mary Gates, was a school teacher, University of Washington Regent, and a chairwoman of United Way International. At the age of 13, he became interested in software and began programming computers during his teenage years. Bill Gates and Paul Allen ran a small company called Traff O Data and sold a computer to the city of Seattle that could co count city traffic. In 1973, Bill Gates became a student at Harvard University where he met Steve Ballmer, now Microsoft Chief Executive Officer. While still a Harvard, a Harvard undergraduate, Bill Gates wrote a version of programming language, BASIC, for the MITS Altair microcomputer. In 1975, before graduation, Gates left Harvard to form Microsoft with his childhood friend Paul Allen. The pair planned to develop software for, for the newly emerging personal computer market. Bill Gates' company Microsoft is famous for their computer operating systems and killer business deals. All right, now let's have let's have someone to read it for us. Oh, Yusef. Okay, uh, Yusef, please read the uh, first and second paragraph, and then Cream, please read the third paragraph. Bill Gates came from a family of entrepreneurship and high-spirited liveliness. William Henry Gates III was born in Seattle, Washington on October 28, 
October 20th, 1955. His father, William H. Gates II, is a Seattle attorney. His late mother, Mary Gates, was a school teacher, University of Washington Regent. Chairwoman of United Way International. At the age of 13, he became interested in software and began programming computers. During his teenager years, Bill Gates and Paul Allen ran a small company called Trafford Data sold a computer to the city of Seattle that could count city traffic. Okay, thank you, Yusuf. Okay, um, Grim number 34, please read. Okay, thank you so much, uh, Yusuf and Krim. Now, let's go ahead uh, with our question. Okay, now, the first question we have is, who is Bill Gates? Okay, this is for everyone, not... He made that software. Ah, yes, Bill Gates is the founder of... Software. Okay, uh, Microsoft Software. Okay, thank you so much. Okay, now the next question is, what is the name of his company? New Company, Microsoft. Oh, yes, Microsoft. Okay, you answer like this. The name of his company is, okay, number 12, can you do it again? Okay, the name of his company is New Company, Microsoft. Okay, very good. Now, this is for everyone. I hope that you uh, remember. It is actually in our, in our article. Okay? Uh, when is the birthday of Bill Gates? October 28th, 19th. Okay, now, one more, one more question. How old is he when he became interested in software? 13. 13 okay very good thank you so much class for your cooperation and bye bye